For the 2017 Worlds this year, we created a song that has the elements that we've had in the past, but tried to refine them into a more kind of personal sound to really capture the struggle that the champions have to go through to become legends. I created a couple different demos, instrumental demos, of what the sound of the song could be. He sent me a chord progression, just a little bit of piano, and we were kind of surprised how quickly it came together. I wrote him a verse a few hours later, sent it to him at night. He wrote me back, he said, keep going. When we heard Chrissy's voice, we knew there's something very special right away. Legends never die. They become a part of you. Against the current, the sound they had, it really embodied the message of it. Uh, it has that vulnerability in the beginning and then the power at the end. My level one. The first time we met with them, it, right away, that was a really easy connection between all of us. Um, they're gamers, uh, she plays League and streams. Something that's beyond just, uh, yeah, we need a song, can you sing it? So, kill the minions. Our main champion is Annie. She was the first champion I like truly learned. I think she's like feisty. I think she's very complicated. Like, you know, it's not just this little girl. She's also got this like fire spirit. So I kind of identify with her too. When recording the song, I was trying to think of like an actual physical battle. What is mental, emotional, and physical desperation combined all look like? And what does it feel like to come out of that? The message we were trying to get across from this was what it would be like to be center stage at Worlds with, you know, 50,000 people around you, however many millions watching online. What does that feel like, that moment where the world is watching you? What are you gonna do? The song really speaks to the, the struggle that the teams have to go through. Each player has to go through a lot of work to become champions. It really just talks about pushing through those things to come out on top. Their failures are okay, and instead of being steps back, they're actually steps forward towards, you know, solutions and victories. Pick yourself up, pick yourself up.